Mm-hmm. And the, the story that just comes to mind was the panel, there was a, there was a company, representative of a company there that was doing genetic sequencing, mm-hmm. right? genome sequencing. Right. And he was saying during this discussion that they can now do it for $100, right? And we're coming from a, you know, it used to be a million, million bucks, I think, in 2007. And mm-hmm. then it was like still thousands in the U.S. And so to add a bit of drama to the panel, I pulled out my wallet and I took the hundred dollar bill. I'm like, okay, let's do this. Right? Right, right, right. <laughs> and so after the, he's like, okay, we're going to make it happen. After the, 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 the panel, they came around, they took my blood. And then not only did I get the, geno- the full genome sequencing, there was also an app. It was in Mandarin, but, yes, yeah, right. but there was a full app to be able to understand it and all technologies that were not really available to mass market in, in, in the U.S. at all. And they didn't even make me pay the hundred dollars. So I, the question is to you as to say a lot of the perception from the outside is that, you know, there's a lot of copycatting slash, you know, not real innovation happening in Asia. 